Howdy, howdy, and welcome to another episode of the Climate Action Homes podcast. I'm super excited today to be with Jared Dreyer. He is the Vice President of Consumer Lending with Westera Credit Union. And if you have been wondering about how you can pay for solar or other home energy improvements around your house, heat pumps, insulation, all kinds of cool stuff, then you are in the right place. With that, let us just dive right in. Welcome. Thanks so much for being here, Jared. Thanks so much, Joan, for having me. We're thrilled to be a part of your podcast, so this is awesome. Jared, before we dive in and talk about this Renew loan that West Air is one of the credit unions that offers that, I just want to ask you, how did you get into working for a credit union? Sure. Yeah. Happy to share my story with you. So I've been in the financial sector now for about 22 years. I started out as a mortgage loan officer and then made my way over to Wells Fargo and then Belco Credit Union. And credit unions are awesome. And the reason is, is we are member owned, meaning that those who bank with us are actually owners of the credit union. And because of that, we are able to offer better rates, both in savings and checking accounts and then lower rates on loans because we're member owned and we're not for profit. And so it's been a huge blessing to be at a local credit union here in Colorado. This is my second one where decisions are made locally. We have the opportunity to work with a program like Renew with the state of Colorado and the Colorado Clean Energy Fund, where we can help make an impact in our state and make our state a more green and better place for everyone. And I just absolutely love what I do. And I have a lot of fun doing it, helping our members find ways to finance their projects and better their lives. So I absolutely love what I do. That is really cool. And I think when people have some misgivings about Chase Bank or some of the others, if they're concerned about if they're financing pipelines or other things they might've heard about, it's really nice to be able to have some Colorado credit unions that we can be working with that might align better with people's values. All right. So would you start by telling us what is the Colorado Clean Energy Fund and just a quick overview of the Renew loan? Yeah, definitely. So the Colorado Clean Energy Fund was put together by the state of Colorado in an effort to help further green initiatives within the state of Colorado. And what they did is they came up with the Renew program and the Renew program is specifically built to provide and get financing tools to homeowners in Colorado who are looking to find renewable sources of energy for their home or even energy efficient products. So this could be anything from solar on top of their houses to geothermal to maybe they get some energy efficient appliances going that will help not only them save money and make their lives a little bit more economically feasible and better, but it's also gonna help the state and it's gonna help the state use less energy and it's gonna help the state become more green. So this is a really cool coalition between not just contractors such as yourself or other providers that are out there, but also the credit unions, the state and the homeowners to just work together to further these initiatives. So it's a great program to be a part of and we're thrilled to be one of the three credit unions that's in it. Yeah, Power, our solar company, just recently got approved to be on the list of one of the approved contractors. It's a really nice option for us to have, you know, as people are trying to figure out, should I go cash? Should I go with one of these solar loan programs? Or would this Renew program be right for me? I think that you have a bunch of different lending products and Renew is one of them. What do you offer as West Air when people are saying, I want to do some energy efficiency improvements, but I also maybe need to take care of some other items that may not be energy efficiency. What are sure. some of the options that, that you guys would point people to? We've got a lot of different options and each situation is going to be totally unique. So we're able to custom tailor our solution to help the homeowner achieve the goals that they're trying to do. So for example, we have the Renew loan, but we also have a Westera energy efficient loan. So some projects are able to go through the Renew program, but Renew has some guidelines. So if it falls outside of those guidelines, we can also use the Westera energy efficient loan. Westera also has a home improvement loan. And those three loans are really unique because all three, the Renew, Westera energy efficient loan, and the home improvement loan 
are not tapping into the homeowner's existing equity. Now we do securitize the loan when we can using a UCC one filing, and we'll do that on solar systems or other big upgrades that are happening to the home, but we're not tapping into that equity, which means that you can still utilize that equity if you need to through a HELOC or a mortgage loan if you wanted to take cash out. And we have those as well. So we have a lot of homeowners that will come to us and say, I wanna do a really big project. I wanna do solar on my roof. Maybe I need a new roof, but I also wanna redo my kitchen. I may wanna finish my basement and we can do a mix and match of different loan types or put it all into a single HELOC and get it all done that way as well. So we have lots of different options to help our homeowners succeed. We will talk to those homeowners and find the best product for them because each product has their own little unique twists and turns, and we want to make sure we get them into the right one. Okay, that makes sense. So if you're doing a home improvement loan, maybe you need to address some plumbing or something like that that really isn't an energy efficiency measure that would fall outside of the Renew loan. Yes, exactly right. So lots of different projects that could be handled through any of our loan types. But uh, yeah, we definitely love the Renew program. There's a lot of options using the Renew loan that the homeowners can not just do the solar, but they can also finance some other projects as part of that as well. Yeah, I think that's so important. If you need insulation or if you want to electrify, do a heat pump, something along those lines that you'd be able to package that all. Can people do more than one Renew loan? Let's say that they go with solar first and then they later go to a heat pump or vice versa? So yeah, if needed, we can definitely do more than one. We can also consolidate those all into a single loan so there's a single mm -hmm. payment, as long as it doesn't exceed the thresholds within the Renew program. There is an approval process that we do have to go through with the Colorado Clean Energy Fund to get those loans done. But we have a very close relationship with the team over there and we're able to say, hey, here's the project, here's what everyone's looking to do, and usually get that to all work into a single loan if needed. Gotcha. All right. Another question I was going to ask you is just some of the information about the terms and the interest rates and how these might compare to what other options people might have out there right now. Sure. So the Renew loan is definitely our go-to loan. It's the primary loan we like to use. And that is because of our partnership with the Colorado Clean Energy Fund and the way that we've built that with the state. Because of that relationship, we're able to offer a better rate on the Renew loan than we are on some of our other loans. So that's going to save the homeowner some money. We do offer terms anywhere from one or two months if they wanted to do something really short term, all the way up to 240 months, which is a 20-year loan. So what we find is most homeowners, when they're looking to do a solar project or renewable energy product that's going to be going on their roof and it's going to offset their utility bill, they want to look to a 20-year product because the payment on that loan is going to be very close to what they were paying Excel Energy or they're paying IREA or one of the other providers out there. And by doing that, it's a payment offset, meaning that their payment to Excel is going to go down. They're going to have a new loan payment, but that dollar amount is going to usually be pretty close to the same. And that way they're not out of pocket. And then in time, once they get that paid off, that payment goes away. And now they're saving money the rest of their lives as long as they're in that property. So a lot of our members do look to that 240 month loan and those rates even on the longest loan are usually better than what HELOCs are out in the market, even though those are secured against the home and the renews against the UCC one filing. At the end of the day, we definitely love a renew loan. That's where we usually like to start. And the best part about it is if they do a solar project and they're going to get that tax credit back. If they get that money back into their pocket, we are able to work with them if they want to make a large payment to their loan. And we're able to re amortize that loan for free, meaning that if they put an extra $10,000 down a year from now, we can lower their monthly payment or shorten their term and get them into a payment that they want to have to get this paid off as quickly as possible. And I'll be honest, most of our homeowners come in and say, hey, just lower my payment. I just want the lowest one possible. And we're able to do that. And it's not just with the tax incentive credit that they get back, but if they get a bonus at their job, we're able to do that as well. And like I said, this is free for them to do. So it's a really great program where they can continually be working on lowering that payment and getting that loan paid off. 
maybe we could talk about the fees. People are familiar. If you're getting a mortgage on your house, there might be some points on that loan and you might pay more points to get a lower interest rate. What other fees can people expect if they are, are going with this renew loan? Yeah, great question. So we do have a $32 UCC one filing fee for the renew loan. Other than that, that's really about it. The homeowner does need to become a member of West Air if they are not already, which is $5, but we cover that actually for them. They will see the line item on their paperwork, but that's going to be paid for by us because we're just glad to have them as a member and to do this loan for them. So really the only fee that they're going to see on the renew loan is that one time $32 fee to get that UCC one filing completed. No origination fee, no points, nothing else out there at all. So it's a very inexpensive loan to do. And in addition to that, all of our loans at West Air with the Renew loan is 90 days to first payment. So we don't have any payments due in the first 90 days, which when you're working with a solar provider or other renewable energy provider, and there's obviously a project that needs to happen, that's perfect for them to get the loan set up, make that payment to the contractor, and then give the contractor time to complete their work and get them turned on before those payments ever start coming due. So we try to work with the contractor and the homeowner to make it as ideal as possible. And in the current market right now, maybe supplies may take a little longer. So not everything's perfect, but we do try to get it set up so that that 90 days is for the homeowner to get the install done and to start seeing that savings before they make their first payment. Yeah. And as you said, in Colorado, sometimes those installs are a little longer, but at least you're going to have a few months head start yes. <laughs> to get that project going. Okay. And so the Colorado Clean Energy Fund, so it's basically that relationship is what ends up allowing this product to come in at a lower rate with zero down payment. Is it that relationship? Yeah. So the Colorado Clean Energy Fund, again, their job is to really further these green initiatives and to get Coloradans aware of the programs that are out there and the availability of financing to get these jobs done at a great low rate. So we've worked with them on an agreement to keep rates as low as possible, better than other market rates that are out there, just so that we can help our Colorado homeowners get into these products and get their homes to become more green and to help the energy efficiency across the entire state. So all that together, is, it builds a great relationship, but it gives the homeowner a great rate on their financing for the Renew projects. Yeah. And I think a lot of times people don't really understand like how amazing it is. You're talking about something that's usually say 20 to $60,000, for example, with zero down payment and just, it's, it's not like a car where somebody's really going to take that back. The worst case is somebody could the company could remove the solar panels. Yeah, uh, and it's really actually low risk for the homeowner. And the reason it's low risk for the homeowner is because we've not ever had to go take anyone's panels off, but it's that payment transfer. So basically not paying Excel anymore or not paying IREA, they're able then to apply what they were paying on their utility bill towards this loan until they get it paid off. So for most people, it's just a swap of payment. And so it's very affordable. It's very low risk. We've got a lot of options when it comes to making it affordable for the homeowner with those longer terms. So that way we can make sure that they're getting into a payment they're comfortable with and they're going to be able to make for years to come. Yeah, that's right. The thing about paying for solar is it's not like you're coming up with that extra money. You already have some stream of money that is going to Excel or whatever your electric company is already. So people are used to paying that and not everybody is super happy yeah. <laughs> with that relationship right now as the rates just really jumped up. So it is nice when people are like, man, I'm stuck. There's nothing I can do. Actually, you could change that and have it be something that really builds equity. We talk about owning your electricity compared to renting. So people who already own their home tend to get that pretty quick. Yep. It makes a huge difference. I have it on my own home and I can say it's made a substantial savings for us, which is nice. Yeah, for sure. That's great. And so what about the process? What are some of the timelines that people can expect? I just clicked the link. I'm showing that up here of if you decide to apply for the renew loan, 
what are some of the steps in there that people could expect? Yeah, so the easiest way to get started is, of course, you can go to westeracu.com, which is our website, and you can complete an application there on our borrowing page for home loans for the Renew product. And you've got it up on the screen right now. The application is actually very short, very easy to do. And once that comes in, we will let the homeowner know right away whether or not they're approved because the parameters for this loan are very fixed into a box. Most of our homeowners obviously are approved. It's very easy to get them approved for this loan. And then from there, usually they're already identifying a contractor that they're working with or they're getting multiple bids. Now, through the Colorado Clean Energy Fund and the Renew program, Westair has actually created a portal that we have provided to over 50 different contractors here in Colorado for solar lending. When they do the bid process, they're actually able to tell the homeowner, hey, through Westair, here's what your payment would look like. And we can send an application to your phone. You can complete it over the phone. And then we take care of everything else from there directly with the contractor and get the loan all squared away on your behalf. So it's super easy to do, whether you go through our website or you go through the contractor, but we've got lots of cool digital tools. These loans all close digitally. So whether it's on your phone or through your email on your computer or tablet, we want to make it as easy as possible on the homeowner. And we absolutely just love all the new technology that we've been given and that we've been able to provide to our solar contractors as well. Yeah, it's pretty cool too, because I know some of the innovations that Westera has pioneered are now going to be adopted statewide. Yes. Jared, you and I started talking about this a couple of weeks ago and just a couple of days ago, uh, one of our clients went ahead and started this process. She filled that out within a couple minutes. She got a kind of a pre-approval. Yep. And so what are the steps then after someone fills out the application, what happens next? Sure. So once that pre-approval comes back through, our next steps are we will reach out to the solar contractor that the homeowner has selected and we will get the project plan. Obviously there's gonna be a quote with the plan of how many panels are going up, what inverters going in, are we doing a battery or not? And we will get all that information then over to the Colorado Clean Energy Fund. They will review that plan as well. And both Westera and the contractor need to be approved on that. That usually takes just a couple hours once we get that email sent in. Once it's all approved, we know that this project is good to go. And we will then work with the contractor on the scheduling, depending on how long it takes to get the materials or how far backed out the utility companies are and getting this installed and getting it all turned on for the homeowner. We will get all that figured out with the contractor. And then we back into our dates and try to get as close to that install date as possible for the loan closing. So that way that 90 days goes into effect and they can get the install done and start seeing those savings before they make a payment. So we do all, a lot of that work for the homeowner and work with the contractor. And like I said, once we get all those dates figured out, we just send them the closing documents digitally. They sign and then we pay the contractor directly for them on their behalf. Basically, they just start by doing the application and then whatever the other steps are, they'll be able to hear back from that. Yes. Um, just doing kind of a recap. So the Renew Loan is part of this partnership with the Colorado Clean Energy Fund and the rates are lower. Is there also a hundred dollar fee to the Colorado Clean Energy Fund? Not for West Air. West Air is actually paying that on behalf of oh, the homeowner. Right. So yeah, we cover that cost for them. So the mm -hmm. only fee for the homeowner at all is the $32 UCC one filing fee that we finance into the deal for them. Okay, great. The other question that came up is about the regional coverage. What counties does Westera offer this in? Great question. So Westera is a state chartered credit union here in Colorado. And in fact, if you live in Colorado, we can help you no matter what. Now, we do have some counties, especially around the Denver metro area, where that makes you eligible for membership with Westera. But if you live in the mountain communities or you're in a different part of Colorado, we have different ways to make you eligible for membership and we will get you taken care of. So don't worry about it. Wherever you live in Colorado, we can take care of your Renew loan and we will get this done for you. Okay, cool. So can people apply on that same link, even if they are yep. out of one of those 
counties. Yeah, so regardless of where you live in Colorado or whether or not you're a member with us yet or not, go through, do the application. We will get it figured out on our end, how we get you qualified. And okay. then we will get that all taken care of for you on your behalf, paid for by Westera. Okay, cool. Yeah, because that just came up that someone in Larimer County was looking at this. And so we weren't quite sure. That's a good tip for us to know. This is a terrific resource and I love that it's statewide. I also love that it's credit unions. And uh, as you were saying, you already worked with another credit union before. And I think the credit unions are all very, they're in a club. Yes. <laughs> they're supportive of each other. Yes, very much so. So regardless of whether or not you want to do your loan with Westera, we've got Elevations Credit Union as part of this program, as well as the Clean Energy Credit Union. And whoever you want to work with, work with them because we're all credit unions. We're all very supportive of one another. We want to see each other succeed, but more importantly, we want to see the homeowner succeed. And we want to make sure they get financing that works for them and can complete their project for them. So whenever you're working with a credit union, you're going to win. So that's our motto. And we want to make sure that our homeowners are going to the right places. Perfect. Is there any last thing that you wanted to mention before we wrap up, Jared? No, Joan, this has been great. And thank you so much for having me on your podcast today. We love working with you guys and we love working with the Colorado Clean Energy Fund and definitely look forward to helping more of your homeowners. Excellent. All right. Thanks everybody. And tune in for another episode of the Climate Action Homes podcast. And if you are looking to go solar, maybe you want to start a career in solar or you want to become one of our solar ambassadors, then reach out. Would love to bring you into the team so you could be part of this renewable revolution. Thanks again, Jared, and we'll see you all again.